Hello, my name is Stephen Parton and I'm an application engineer here at Carolina Motion Controls. Today we will be demonstrating how to set up the Unidrive M700 in analog mode. First we will set up the analog input through using the wizard and showing how to set it up in menu 7. Next we will select the reference mode of A1A2 so that way the motor will follow the analog speed reference. So let's dive in. All right, so the analog I.O. of the Unidrive M700 uh, can be set up via the under setup and then using the analog I.O. wizard. So if we zoom in here, uh, we can see our terminals on the drive, five and six. Uh, we do actually have something set up on that so we can see as we increase um, our value here, we can see that working. So come in here to the setup of that. Um, our analog input one mode is voltage. Double click on it. We can change it uh, depending upon what yours is. Ours is volts so zero to ten volts. Um, these are kind of read only parameters so there's nothing that you can actually do. That's kind of showing you the percentage. So right now we're about 50, about halfway on the potentiometer so we're showing about 50. Um, if we have an offset here say of 5% and we can see that we, that we have actually changed where the destination value is. So if I change this back to a zero, now we change that value. If we went the other way, we can go to negative 5% and now we can see the value went lower. If we go to zero, it'll be zero, but we'd have to cross over that negative 5 before we ever jumped up. All right, uh, scaling, this is where you can change uh, scaling. So you could do a two to one. So once we jump up over that percentage here, you can now max this can be 3000 there. Um, but at 50%, we're looking at 3000 versus 100%. You can see that there. And you have to take into account the offset too, so it'd actually be 55. So right about there, we can see now we're at 3,000. And that's due to the fact that we're doubling that uh, using our scaling factor and then our, subtracting the 5. So we'll, the potentiometer is at 55 minus the 5 is 50. Double it, it's actually 100%. So we're given our 100% value. In this case, we're doing a speed reference uh, 0 to 3,000 RPM. Now if we wanted to invert it, do that on. Okay, and now we, we go to zero. All right, so cut that back off. Just okay. All right, so let's go down. Um, so that's through the wizard, but then we can also come into menu seven, the analog IO setup. And now uh, we can see here all the same information that we were looking at just a moment ago. So analog input one mode. Set up as volt. In our case, uh, this is where we had our scaling set up. You can invert it, and then that shows you the destination. Uh, as of right now, it's set up for the analog reference one destination. Uh, menu one parameter 36. So if we had our drive set up in analog mode, we would be following that speed reference. Uh, so right now, we can see our drive is set up A1, A2 speed mode. So if we gave oops, down here, so if we gave our drive the enable and the run command, we would be running at 682.8 RPM around about. And as you can see right now, uh, we are running 690, 688. Uh, the analog signal jumping around a little bit. And if we put our potentiometer at about half, you can see we jump up to about 3,000 RPM. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy.